Which AI chatbot will you choose as your co-pilot? Over the course of just two years, generative AI has become a must-have for vendors and a necessity for businesses. But with so much innovation in so little time, it's easy to get lost in the details. What's an LLM and what happened to BARD? Which chatbot belongs to which vendor and what makes one different from another? We'll answer some of these questions today. Keep watching to learn the difference between three leading AI services, Microsoft Copilot, Google Gemini, and OpenAI's ChatGPT. To go further down the generative AI rabbit hole, visit our dedicated enterprise AI site at the link above or in the description below. And remember to like and subscribe for more videos on all things business tech. Let's start with Microsoft Copilot, or as you may have first known it, Cortana, then Bing Chat. One evolved into the other, getting new capabilities and use cases along the way. It runs on multiple large language models, including OpenAI's GPT-40 and Dolly 3. Copilot's main differentiator from other chatbots is that it's embedded in Windows apps like Excel, Teams, Outlook, and PowerPoint. And while it's also available as a standalone app, this integration sets up Copilot to act more like an assistant. It can automate repetitive tasks like summarizing documents, suggest new ideas based on context, remind you to send critical emails or messages, schedule projects and analyze project progress, and more. Before Copilot, there was Google Bard, which soon evolved and rebranded as Gemini. Gemini runs on the Gemini family of LLMs. Gemini supplements Google Search and can be integrated into websites, messaging platforms, and other Google apps like Gmail, Docs, Maps, and YouTube. Gemini is more oriented toward being a content generator when compared to Copilot as an assistant. Gemini is most often used for text generation, text summarization, speech recognition, image and video description generation, and code generation, among other uses. And last but not least, OpenAI's ChatGPT, the one that is largely considered to have started the generative AI frenzy. ChatGPT might even be used informally to reference any kind of AI chatbot. Revealed in late 2022, ChatGPT has been through many evolutions of LLMs. It originally used GPT-3, and as of this video, offers access to GPT-3.5, GPT-4, GPT-4 Turbo, and GPT-4.0. Like Gemini, ChatGPT is a generative AI chatbot first and foremost. It can be used to generate code, compose music, draft emails, summarize text, create quizzes, rewrite content, and generate art, among other uses. ChatGPT's underlying LLMs are also used in Copilot's Microsoft Suite integrations like Bing Search, whereas Google Gemini integrates exclusively with Google Search. What do you think? Which AI chatbot service best fits your individual or business needs? Share your thoughts in the comments and remember to like and subscribe too.